I'm just outside Caladim here. Um, I'm going to do my bone chip turn in quest, but uh, I'm going to farm up a few more skeletons first. Um, this guy's level 9. I was also running here to do um, crush bone belts, but uh, yeah, even at level 9, the experience from the bone chips is still pretty good. Um, I suppose four or five chips is probably equivalent to the same as handing in a crush bone belt, uh, which explains why bone chips are still 10 platinum a stack on this server, because it's a very good quest. You can still get visible experience from the quest even into like level 20 or so. So it's kind of nice for finishing off a level when you want to get spells or what have you. Oh, these guys are being cheap. Really good spawn out here for skeletons. Anyhow, I'm going to round these guys up and then uh, go do the turn in and see what I get for experience. Alright, so I'm doing my turn in now for bone chips. So supposedly um, you can uh, hand faction items in. Um, four, sorry, 16 at a time, as opposed to just um, four at a time. Let's see how much XP I get for this first, but... Okay, so like half a blue. So this should be two blues if this works. If not, that's a huge waste of bone chips, but we'll see. Cannot give stacks of items to NPCs. Okay, so that answers that question. Uh, I was just noticing on the wiki that um, um, on their faction page that you can hand um, quest NPCs four stacks of four as opposed to um, just single. So I'm going to definitely make this a lot faster. But Anyhow, so as you can see, it's still relatively decent experience even at level 10. And like I said, I've, I've handed these in even up to level 20 in that. Uh, yeah, it takes you a couple stacks to get a blue. But it's not too terrible. Anyhow, yes, yeah, so that's what I do to uh, level my low-level characters. Um, definitely gives you a good boost over just hunting.